Uh, hello everyone, this is Darren here for, Darrow or Darren, uh, here for another video. And um, this is, this will be another Tech Ops video. I want to make this short and sweet now, I just want to make this in one to one part, so. I'm just going to make these Tech Ops brief now, just try to make them the same way as someone I know does them. Um, and not make them 30 minute death blogs, because I'm just getting, it's just, nah. No one wants to watch 30 minutes of me, and I tend to fucking just ramble on over sh just pointless crap. I want to ramble on and just do an alternative blog then. So anyway, I got a few games here over the last few month, and um, since the last blog I did, we've well, seen on one already. But let's get going with the most the one furthest back, which is Heavy Rain, Um got heavy rain so it did. Um I wasn't interested in it so I wasn't really interested in it until I played the demo so it didn't but I did get it at the end of the day after playing the demo so thought it was great. And I really enjoyed the game though. I just really liked the, the story in it. It just immer got me immersed into it after a while. And I loved the quick time events and it, it just reminded me of Shemmy so it did. Um it's just a great, it's just a great game though. I just really enjoy playing it. The, the graphics really, especially when during the loading screens, they're just really cool. Just the way you see Scott Shelby's face, just really, you know, really kind of, just really realistic in a way. So it is. But I really enjoyed the game though, and it's just cool the way it's different endings and things like that. Um, I think I got, I got the best ending though. None of my characters died or anything like that. And I, um. But I recommend you pick it up. Next game was this here, God of War Collection, and um, this is the US version because it's not out here yet. Um, it is out now if you have the God of War Ultimate 3 Ultimate Edition, which has it, which comes with it. But if you don't, then you just you have to wait till April because I think it's coming out on its own in April. And um, I got this. Basically, I don't need anything really to say about this. I finished the first one on this here in hard mode, but I loved God of War, and um, this is just it's just a refined version of it with the graphics and that there. It's just still top notch a action, and like even if you look, even if you already have the games, I already have the games, but I wanted to get this anyway. Um, but I don't care. I love the game. It's brilliant games. Love it. Um. Next game I got, which I'll, is going to be another video on this here, along with this one, because I actually just finished it just a couple of hours ago, and I want to give my detailed thoughts on it, and um, not really a review now, because I actually I'm going to do a written review for it, because I've sh I'm going to talk about another game I actually did a re review on, um, momentarily. And that is Final Fantasy Thirteen. It came out on the 9th of March. I finished it. 30th of March was that 21 uh, three weeks pretty much. So it did uh, get me to finish it, which is pretty good because I pretty much played nothing but this, and um, a lot with um for the past like several weeks. So well, not nearly nothing but it now, but I played a lot of it now. Just really focused on trying to finish it now. But as I said, I'll, I'll be doing another video for it, and um, so I'll talk more about it there. Though, but if you don't want to watch it, I just said I enjoyed the game. But there are better RPGs out there, and um, the gameplay is great though, and that story's kind of eh, it's decent enough. But it's definitely the weakest part in the game. But it's a good game nonetheless. Next one, it's God of War Three, and. Um, I was really looking forward to this game because of the fact of the matter is I love the God of War series. I think it's brilliant. Um, I just cannot, just couldn't wait for it though. It's, it's gonna be awesome. And I got it there when it came out, and I really did enjoy it. Um, brilliant game. And um, the graphics on it are just um, really stunning though. Um, look at though, like if you have like a HD set though, they just look fantastic. Look at it's definitely one of the best looking PS3 games. Um, 
just the way that Kratos looks though and just the way you fight like the start of the, the opening battle that was just brilliant to do though and there's a few other set pieces in the game that are just like just great as well though and um the last boss and it was disappointing though just the fact is I didn't have a hard time with it um, and although I did love the game I think I prefer the second one mainly because the fact is I just I just the flow of this game just didn't really work well for me though it's just it's just something about the flow of it you know just like you enjoyed like there was not not all the parts in it were really like fun though they were not were like fun they weren't really like, great though for the most part, but it's still a great game, no doubt, and I really did enjoy it at the end of the day. Um, I actually forgot I got two other games, I'm not going to show them here now, but I also got two DS games, which were Dragon Quest Chapters of the Chosen, or Dragon Quest 4, and Blue Dragon Plus on the DS, which I got, I got that for £5, and I got Chapters of the Chosen for £8. And uh, I played a bit of each, so I did, and they're good games, so um, I'll probably play them probably sometime soon, though, um, since I'm done, um, sometime down the road anyway, just to check them out. And uh, the most recent games, which I got there um, last Saturday, so I did, is Sonic and Sega All Star Racing. And just cause two, and I got these both for less than fifty pound because this was already twenty four ninety nine in Sainsbury's, and this was like thirty seven like pound and not there, and I had uh, my ten pound voucher which I got for like being a good worker, the shining stars thing and work, and also um an employee discount fifteen percent discount as well so. I got them for forty two seventy seventy um overall which was good. Um I played a couple of hours of this, really enjoyable, I really like it. It's a fun it is a Mario Kart ripoff at the end of the day, but it's a good one at that. Um just it's just a lot of fun to play though. And basically the thing in this is you have to drift though in order to speed boost and pretty much that. that's pretty much what it is though, you have to drift. If you know how to drift really well, then you should do well in the game. Anyway, and I played like just about ten. I just played the first mission in this, though. I wasn't actually going to get this, but the fact of the matter is that I was listening to a podcast I listened to, and the person I was just describing his experience with it, and I just actually persuaded me to get it, though. Um, and I like I got the I had the first game, but I thought it was. Dull. I just found it really dull though, but I've heard this is actually quite an improvement on the first one, so I'll probably ch I'll, I'll probably play it, and um, this probably be the next game I'll probably play, because um, since I'm done with um, Final Fantasy 13 now, and that makes my completed games this year to 12, which I think is very good though, I've actually completed 4 games each month, I've played 4 in January, 4 in February, and 4 this month and I want to complete I said, I said I want to complete at least 15 by the end of April which should be done anyway there's a few games I want to go back to in some play as well so um, that should be accomplished I said I want to make complete 50 games by the end of the year and if I, if I go away the way I am I should do that no problem now uh, I can't be like 4 now I have to make a few more extra games for a few months in order to accomplish that but it should be fine and um, that's pretty much all I have to say that's all my pickups this month though I actually made this short and sweet as I said and um, I didn't make it 30 minutes long and um, actually I forgot to mention though that the I did a review of God of War 3 so I did and um, where is it now and um, on a site called Gamer Your Foy Euphoria, GamerEuphoria.com though, um, so if you want to, ch I'll probably post a link to it on the actual description bar anyway, so check that out, and I actually will be doing a review of this game as well on said site, so look out for it though, um, soon enough as well, 
Um, so anyway, that is me for now. Um, I don't know if I'll do in one next month now because the fact is I'm not really getting any games until my birthday. So I'll probably do a blog around my birthday time though because at the end of next month my birthday is the 29th of April. So I'll probably do a video then um, showing probably what I've gotten for my birthday and things like that then. So anyway, that's all and I'll see you all next time. Peace out.